what you just watched was essentially my pretty normal morning. Um, I tried to get up at 5.30 to have time to read every morning um, and pray. Most mornings that's successful. Um, it depends a lot on when Lukey gets up. Today, for instance, he got up at about 5.45. So I basically just had time to read, didn't really have time to pray. Um, and then once Lukey gets up, Liz gets up and then, you know, typical days, just make him breakfast, eat some breakfast, play with him. And then I try to get out the door by 7.45, 7.50 this morning. So a little late, but I'm five minutes from the office. So it's not a huge, huge deal. Um, and then each day at the office, which I think is what most people cared about when I was being asked to kind of show a little behind the scenes of what a day in life um, looks like. Because, I mean, if you watch our disc golf content, which I'm assuming if you're watching this, you do, then content's only a small part of what we do at Foundation, um, especially my job. And so a lot of people, I think, are just curious as to what on earth we do at work because it's like a, it's kind of mysterious, you know? Um, so today on the docket, as far as my schedule looks, first thing when we get in, um, we'll do Grip Locked, our weekly podcast. I typically try to plan that on Sunday nights. I was able to last night on nights when I can't, I'll get in and um, I always have a general idea as to what to talk about just because I'm so immersed in the disc golf scene that I kind of know the storylines, but try to have that outline done Sunday night. If not, I'll do it, do it or finish it up Monday morning. I have it done today, so we'll walk in, um, get straight to filming Grip Locked at, I believe, 10 this morning. Um, we have a meeting to go over some of the um, logistics and stuff for USDGC, um, try to figure out more of our role down there, who all needs to go, um, what exactly is going to look like, and then assign out tasks to make sure everything's done on time before we get down there so that once we get down there, it's just smooth sailing this year. Um, we're trying to get a lot more forward thinking and ahead of planning instead of being a reactionary company, um, which has been great this year. Uh, so USDGC meeting will go down from probably 10 to 11. Um, we'll eat lunch. And then the afternoon on Mondays is typically social media filming. So typically that means Trevor and I'll grab all the discs that are going to be released this week. If Trevor has any ideas as far as like shorts to make, um, whether it be like little challenges or stuff like that, we typically knock those out Monday afternoon, but today's rainy. So what we'll probably do is, um, today will probably be a lot of office work. Um, I have a bunch of, I have a few emails I got to get to that are very time sensitive. So I'll either be able to get those to those after grip locked or this afternoon. And then, um, probably just more week planning, um, getting, getting ready for September. I have to plan every month. We have a full staff monthly meeting. Um, so I got to plan some for that because that should be next Monday should be when we do it because the first of September is Friday. So, um, that's kind of what it'll look like. Not going to be a super exciting day, but I don't think that's what you all wanted to see. This is a pretty typical day. Um, only weird wrinkle is it's raining, which if you've ever lived in Lynchburg, this is about 50% of our days. So actually this is about a pretty typical day, but let's get to work. Just got back from that meeting over at the warehouse. Um, USDGC plans are in full effect. It's gonna be a good time. Typically we have like one meeting a week, which is our marketing meeting on Fridays. And then sometimes there'll be a second. Next week, Brad and I will have like a finance meeting. And then every once in a while we'll have like a Patreon meeting with uh, Jason's taking that over. So that'll be fun. Um, but yes, yeah, so that was the morning, grip locked emails, meeting, and then always have a healthy lunch. Today it's five taquitos, chicken and cheese. And I don't let everyone, anyone else know about the stash. Connor's gonna get on another secret here, but I have my chip and cookie stash under. What the heck? <laughs> under my desk here so that. How long has that been there? A few days. <laughs> okay. A few weeks, months. Oh. No, just a few days. Cause we ran out of office cookies and snacks and they'll get replenished on September 1st, which is Friday. I need to get through, so. 
I have my secret stash back there. But then the rest of the day, it's gonna be rainy outside, so our usual social promo stuff will get pushed to a different day, which means it's just gonna be desk work. So probably spend an hour like community management, which is just hanging out with you all in whatever form or facet that means. Probably gonna be Discord today. Um, I just saw like two more emails I have to get back to come through, so I'll take care of those and then schedule out some Twitter posts and then the podcast for today and then post, um, cut the clips out of the podcast as far as like, we have this like AI software that does our like social clips. So that'll probably be the rest of the day. Gonna be boring, but hey, you asked for it. And just like that, that's the work day. That's work. What is so bright right here? Oh, it's this. Um, it's right now 3.30 going home a little bit early today because I am actually going to go to the disc golf tryout tonight for the local college. Um, sounds like a good time. Sounds like fun. I played for them. Um, and I've never been back to a practice. I don't think maybe one since I, um, graduated there. Anyway, there's someone walking by my car. Figure when I go to tryouts tonight. Um, so we're gonna go there and we need to be there at 5.30. I thought I needed to be there at six, but coach wants help um, setting something up. So I'm gonna leave work a little early to soften the blow to the wife, um, cause why not? Uh, the rest of the day though was pretty, um, pretty normal. Um, ended up just since lunch, got grip lock thumbnail and scheduled um, imported it into our like clip generator so that we'll have the clips ready in the morning for me. Um, got one of the like long form clips, uh, thumbnailed and everything. Um, had a few behind the scenes stuff with our Patreon Heiser club. We have the Heiser club championships. It's like a invite only disc golf tournament going on in a few weeks. So I had some behind the scenes stuff I don't want to spoil. Um, I was working on and then um, I was also working on some new benefits for our Patreon that's going to be launching September 1st. So I was working on that. Um, again, a little bit behind the scenes. I don't want to spoil because I don't know when this is coming out. Um, so I got some of that stuff done. We also were checking out. Um, we might have to get a new camera because our current camera uh, part went bad. That's like $800 to fix. And we're not positive that that's the true fix. Um, and it's $1,700 to upgrade the camera. So we're thinking through the logistics of that. Our camera we can use, it's just, will we don't know how much longer it'll last. It will go bad here soon. And if we fix it, if we get a new camera now, we can use the current camera as a podcast only camera indefinitely. That one, the problem, that some with the SD card readers, which messed up with it. So anyways, that was kind of the rest of the day. Um, and then I had some like checks to deposit, um, had to balance out the cash box. Um, trying to think if there's anything else. That's kind of the boring stuff. That's what you all wanted to see, I think, was, and obviously you didn't get to see much because there's not really much to see. I was just sitting at my desk all day. Um, it, was a, it was kind of a boring day of work, but that's the behind the scenes of foundation, the operation side. Um, we're now going to go home. We're going to hang out with the fam for a few hours. Mm -hmm and then go to disc golf practice. And then um, ideally we'll be able to leave there with enough time and energy, more so energy than time, to get a run in. It is uh, about, what time even is it? Hold up. It's about 4.15. Lukey just woke up from a nap about 10 minutes ago. So we're just playing in his room. He's playing in his ball pit. Um, and we'll eat some dinner here in a little bit and then I'll leave to go to the disc golf tryouts in about an hour from now. And then that'll get a few clips there and that'll basically be it. Um, yeah, let me comment down below if you're watching this, a uh, few of you who are, comment down below um, what parts of the business that I didn't show today that you want to see. You know, we work on different stuff, different days. So maybe there's something, um, Maybe there's something that you wish I could have shown you today that I didn't get to work-wise. Um, and maybe I'll do another one. I don't know. Just wanted to switch things up for my normal content of the training vlogs, but 
Hopefully we'll figure a way to get some run in today. If not, then normally I take Fridays off before my long runs. I can just run on Friday and just have this be my off day because I did long run yesterday. But yeah, dinner soon, leave shortly after, disc golf tryouts. All right, I'm take this hat off, man. Get me some more light, huh? Just got home from disc golf tryouts. It went great. It was a lot of fun. Um, should have a solid team this year, so it's always a good time to just be a part of the program. It is 8.45, so Liz texted me. Light went out. Liz texted me. Jeez, this is like an emotional sight shot with that intense lighting. And wanted me to bring home some Chick-fil-A, so that's what I'm going to do. Go inside, eat some Chick-fil-A, call it a night, go to bed, and do it all again tomorrow. Hopefully you enjoyed this little glimpse into uh, what a normal day looks like. No running today. Disc golf tryouts replaced running. But normally, um, around that 7 o'clock mark is when I would go out for my run. So, um, yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed this little glimpse into my life. Comment down below if you want to see more videos like this where it's like focused on like one specific day of typically one specific day of training and just like life or around a specific topic or you like the week long just letting you know what's going on yeah see you next time